Hello friends, welcome back to Infigyan. Today in this video, we have one very very interesting question from algebra. Here we have to find the value of a and b such that quartic expression x power 4 minus 3x cube plus ax plus b is divisible by quadratic expression x square minus 2x plus 4. So let's get started. I will be solving this question in two ways. So I will write here m1 method 1. Let's say our dividend which is in the numerator it is n. Let's say our divisor which is in the denominator let's say this is d. So I can write here n over d. This must be equal to quotient q. Let's write n is x power 4 minus 3x cube plus ax plus b. This would be our dividend and divisor is x square minus 2x plus 4. This is equal to quotient q. Now degree of numerator is 4, degree of denominator is 2, Leading coefficient of numerator is 1. Leading coefficient of denominator is 1. So we can say our quotient must have degree 2 with leading coefficient 1. So we can assume Q must be in the form of x square plus cx plus d. Now we can cross multiply. We can write x power 4 minus 3x cube plus ax plus b. This must be equal to x square minus 2x plus 4 times x square plus cx plus d. Now we have to multiply or simplify our RHS. Now we will multiply both the brackets. So I can write after multiplication x power 4 minus 3x cube plus ax plus b. This is our LHS and we will write RHS equal to x square times x square. So leading term would be x power 4. Then we will write c minus 2 times x cube after multiplication and taking common terms, the coefficient of x cube, the coefficient of x square, then we can write our RHS c minus 2 times x cube, then we will be getting d minus 2c plus 4, this is coefficient of x square, 4c minus 2d is the coefficient of x times x and constant is 4d. Now we will compare all the coefficients of equation. So if I will compare coefficient of x cube both sides, I can write c minus 2 equal to minus 3, our first equation, just by comparing coefficient of x cube from both the sides. Now I will add 2 to both sides. We will get c equal to negative 1. So value of c is minus 1. Now we will compare coefficient of x square both sides. In left hand side it is missing. So we will consider coefficient 0. So we can write here coefficient of x square in RHS d minus 2c plus 4 equal to 0. Now I can put the value of c minus 1 over here. I can write d minus 2 times minus 1 plus 4 equal to 0 or we can write d plus 2 plus 4 equal to 0. So d plus 6 equal to 0 will be getting d equal to minus 6. So our c and d both values are 
known now. C is negative 1, D is minus 6. Now if I will write the value of A, it is coefficient of X. So in RHS coefficient of X is 4C minus 2D. So we can write directly A equal to 4C minus 2D. Let's put the values of C and D. We will get 4 times minus 1 minus 2 times minus 6. So we will get minus 4 minus 6 times minus 2 plus 12. Value will be 8. So A must be 8. Now we will compare constant both sides. So in LHS it is B, in RHS it is 4D. So we can write here B equal to 4 times D. D is minus 6. So 4 times minus 6 will give us minus 24. This is the value of B. So our answer becomes A comma B. If I am writing equal to 8 comma negative 24. Now we will solve using method 2 which is long division method. So let me write here method 2. Here we are going to divide our numerator by denominator. So x square minus 2x plus 4 is our divisor and our dividend is x power 4 minus 3x cube plus ax plus b. Now we will take x square times. So x square times x square x power 4 minus 2x times x square minus 2x cube. 4 times x square which we will write here plus 4x square. Now we have to subtract. So sign change must be there. We will change the sign. Now plus x power 4 minus x power 4 will be over. Minus 3x cube plus 2x cube will write minus x cube. Then minus 4x square plus ax plus b. Now we will take minus x times. So x square times minus x. We will write here minus x cube. Minus 2x times minus x. 2x square. 4 times minus x. So I will write minus 4x. Again sign change would be there. Minus plus. Plus and minus x cube will be cancelled out. So we will get minus 6x square plus a plus 4 times x plus b. Now we will take minus 6 times. So x square times minus 6. We will write here minus 6x square. Minus 2x times minus 6. We will write here plus 12x and 4 times minus 6 minus 24. Again we will change the sign. It will be plus here. So plus and minus 6x square will be over. a plus 4 minus 12. We will write a minus 8 times x. Then we have b plus 24. Now our degree is less than the degree of divisor. So we have to stop here. Now this remainder must be 0. This should be 0. Now we have to equate a minus 8 times x plus b plus 24 equal to 0. Let me write here a minus 8 times x plus b plus 24 equal to 0. So I can write RHS equal to 0x plus 0. Now we can easily compare both sides. So a minus 8 must be 0. At the same time we can write constant b plus 24 
they should be equal to 0. Now we will add 8 to both sides here. So plus and minus 8 will be over. We will get a equal to 8. And from second equation, we will subtract 24 from both the sides. Plus and minus 24 will be over. We are going to get B value minus 24. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care. Bye bye.